What's up, everybody? Caleb Wagner, a.k.a. Wags My Tag, coming back inside your eye. And I'm talking about an incredible new story, especially if you're a fan of animation domination. That's right. Family Guy and The Simpsons have finally came to that point in their history where they're going to do a crossover episode. That's right. This news has been in the tube for weeks now, but we finally saw a five-minute clip of the actual episode. That's right. The Griffins end up going to Springfield, right? You don't know how they got to that state. You don't know what state they're in. But they go to Springfield, and what would you know they meet up with America's favorite family, the Simpsons. That's right. Peter ends up pairing off with Homer. you got Stewie and Brian pairing off with Bart, and they're just swaggerjacking each other. Stewie wants to be Bart so bad because he's the bad boy. I love it. You're going to have Lois and Marge doing their family like housekeeper, I don't know, episode crossover where they do crazy things. It's going to be insane, but I absolutely love the fact that Paul Tuckett Pat, the beer in Quahog, Peter Griffin, his occupation is working at Paul Tuckett Pat, like making this beer. It's actually just a rip off of Duff. And I like that that story uh, gets taken out there. You know, if anything is going to get these guys in arms against each other, if anything's going to start a family feud, it is definitely going to be over beer. But I absolutely love this. They have a five minute clip. I'll have a link in the description. You can check it out. And it's got me, like, psyched up, you know. So many new Simpsons episodes, so many new Family Guy episodes, it's hard to keep track. You know, there, there's so many hundreds of uh, both of them that every new episode, I mean, it really needs some kind of flair to keep me infixiated with it, you know. I really like to see stuff like this. I can't wait until they have other crossovers. You know that the Simpsons might end up going to Quahog. That would be pretty sweet. But right now we're in Springfield, and we're going to see the whole list of characters get absolutely ripped apart by the... <laughs> Seth MacFarlane, you know, he's been on the show before. He cannot wait, you know, to make all these observations about all these characters saying that, like, Apu's racist, probably. Stuff like that. I thought it was hilarious. They were inside the uh, airplane, and, you know, Bob from Bob's Burgers was in there, and he's just like, what are you doing here? Uh, funny, I mean... It's absolutely cool. Can't wait to see the episode when it airs, but thought I would talk about it. Thought I would have a link in the description for it. You guys want to see it. The crossover between The Simpsons and Family Guy. The Griffins and The Simpsons finally together. So keep it easy, guys. Rate, comment, subscribe for more of the best on the internet where this is where it's posted. I uh, keep it consistent. Put the best on the internet in front of your faces. Guys, rate, comment, subscribe for more of the best on the internet. But like I said... I want you to stay positive, keep a smile on your face, and never let the frowns keep you down. That sounded weird, but not as weird as this. I love you guys. Keep it easy. Rate, comment, subscribe. Get back at it. Peace, guys. Simpsons and the Griffins.